This tech giant is partnering with a blockchain company to do cool blockchain things. And yeah, it's Google. Ever heard of them? I'm pretty sure you have. So when Google partnered with Dapper Labs, it made a lot of buzz and the partnership was confirmed on Twitter, so we know it's not a hoax. It's an important thing to know, too. I came across this article from Cointelegraph.com, and it said this. Google Cloud will serve as a network operator for Dapper Labs' Flow blockchain, the scalable infrastructure that powers an entire ecosystem of NFTs, games, and apps. If you're not too familiar with what Dapper Labs is, they're responsible for such awesome endeavors such as CryptoKitties, and NBA Top Shots. CryptoKitties was a huge pioneer in the NFT space, but with their game getting huge popularity in 2017, in fact, nearly grinding Ethereum to a halt, as I recall. It, there was a lot of excitement around this CryptoKitties thing back then. And uh, also with NBA Top Shots, I mean, a huge endeavor there, working with uh, the licensor NBA to do these NFTs of awesome moments of different games, I mean, that's a huge accomplishment on Dapper Labs' part as well. And so now, to complete the hat trick, they've partnered with Google themselves. Google, okay, not rando garage company you've never heard of. I'm talking about Google, a company that used to be a random garage company that you've never heard of. So what's my take on this? With NFTs, it's almost like adoption is far less relevant with NFTs because the utility is immediately there. If, if there's a cryptocurrency like, I don't know, Bitcoin, and the point of Bitcoin is to exchange it for goods and services, you have to like wait for adoption so that you can exchange Bitcoin for goods and services. With this with NFT games, like for example, Rev Racing, I don't need adoption. I just need the game to work. I buy my car NFT. I now own my car. I race my car in the game. I don't need adoption for that. I think that NFTs can grow faster because it has like this new DNA inside of it. Uh, that regular like medium of exchange peer-to-peer -peer cryptocurrencies just don't have that. They just don't have that. They need more infrastructure around them in order for them to see their benefit. That's my take on it. I mean, it probably made the video longer, but if you liked my take, let me know in the comments. If you have your own thoughts to add, let me know in the comments. I really appreciate everybody who's commenting on my videos. I mean, even if they get 40 views, they get four comments. I mean, I'm over the moon with that. So thanks for watching and follow, like, subscribe, bye.